Weather and traffic together. We say good morning again to Michelle. Michelle, I know this is going to surprise you, but I have a late afternoon tea time today. I'm a little worried about uh, those rain showers you've been talking about. When you say late afternoon, exactly what time are you talking about, Patrick? 3.30. 3.30? I think you might have a little bit of trouble by the time you around the corner to the back nine. And we'll talk about the timing of it. I think six, seven o'clock in the evening uh, as we approach the sunset is when we're going to start to see our next round of showers and thunderstorms around here. It's dry right now and expecting it to be dry through the morning and most of the afternoon. Top weather headline, it's not going to be quite as hot today. We hit almost 90 for a high yesterday. And then as we get into the uh, evening and nighttime hours, more showers and thunderstorms expected, some of them with some heavy downpours. Uh, Wednesday's not a washout, but the real comfortable and and dry, bright weather holds off until Thursday, and then it's around for a couple of days into the early part of the weekend. About 69 in, North, in Providence right now, 64 in New Bedford, 70 in uh, Newport, and 66 degrees in Westerly. Now, dew point's one of the way that we measure how comfortable the air is. Yesterday, the dew point was actually at about 70 degrees. Today and tomorrow, it's in the middle 60s, which is pretty muggy, but then we really drop down 55 comfortable, especially when you're considering that we're heading into uh, the middle of August. Your future cast this morning, any patchy morning fog is way to some sunshine, but by 11 o'clock in the morning, we may already start to see the clouds thickening up. Future cast here, and I really like the timing of this. Notice the showers just off to our west. I'm going to stop it at 6 o'clock in the evening. So, Patrick, I'm guessing you'll be right around maybe uh, the 10th tee at this point. Showers start to uh, push in through the later evening and the nighttime hours at 11 o'clock in the evening. Scattered showers, some of them heavy at times. They'll continue off and on through the nighttime and early tomorrow morning. Then I think a nice lull for a good part of the day on Wednesday. In the afternoon, there's just a slight chance of an additional shower popping up. So uh, we've kind of shifted the timing a little bit quicker for this wet weather. It's going to be more in the evening and nighttime hours tonight and less so on Wednesday. About 75 for Newport's high today, 78 Charlestown, 81 in Coventry, northern Rhode Island highs in the upper 70s to around 80. Skies turn mostly cloudy and showers in the evening. And it looks like a dry day for Plymouth and New Bedford. After dark, though, the shower threat moves in. Uh, Seekonk at about 80, Middletown at 76. Visibility, it improves through the morning on the bay as the fog continues to thin out. High tides at 515 in the evening, low tide 1019 this morning. The beaches, you'll get in a little bit of partial sunshine. Air temperature 75, water temps around 74 and the safe sun times running at about 20 minutes. Seven day future cast, so some showers around tonight and tomorrow morning. And then just that stray shower thunderstorm Wednesday afternoon. It looks like a warm and humid day at 86. Then dry, comfortable Thursday, Friday and Saturday, low 80s during the day, some good sleeping weather as we head